Shields up, Ironbreakers. How is everybody doing? Hopefully everybody's having a good time today. Hopefully I can improve upon that good time that you guys are having. Um, some of you in chat just now are asking for session ID so that you could join lobbies because apparently there's not a lot of full lobbies and people want to do quests and stuff like that. So, the lobby is now open to everyone. I would just like to remind you guys of one thing, which is whenever I'm hunting a monster for the very first time, I always do it solo first, unless it is a monster like uh, Extreme Behemoth, or Ancient Lashin, you know, monsters that are designed around group play, monsters that are scaled for four players. Those, I really don't care. I'll fight with four people, whatever. But usually, players that do, um, mobs that do have, mobs, monsters that do have uh, solo scaling, I will solo them at least once. Now, let me just see some here. Um, I'm not sure if you guys if you guys notice any major differences, but I did swap the capture card, so hopefully we won't be having the same problems that we've been having uh, some of these days where weird shit just starts happening, but, you know, just keep that in mind and let me know if you see anything weird going on, uh, as always. Now, I did a couple of more optional quests, but today I want to go beat that Kushala, but uh, I think I'm going to craft a new gun lance. I'm gonna stick with the gun lens for it. I'll eventually do like a, a different build that'll make it easier, but I wanna keep killing stuff with the gun lens, to be honest, because I'm just having so much fun that I just don't feel like swapping weapons yet. Even though we got some poor matchups, I still feel like I can make stuff work if I practice. If I practice some more. So, anyways, what was uh, a week two? We gotta go kill that Kushala that we didn't kill last night. Uh, I don't think he's going to be very weak to ice for some strange reason. Yeah, as it turns out, he's not. So we got Dragon Fire. We have a Blast uh, Gun Lance, which means I'm probably going to be using that one again. I'm going to be swapping a couple of things around to see if I can um, get him this time. But I also want to craft a Thunder Gun Lance. I want to craft Zenogre's Gun Lance. I think Zenogre's like one of the one of the best Thunder Gun Lances that you can have, because the other one is Toby Kadachi, and Toby Kadachi's long shelling doesn't even get to six. Whereas with Zenogur, we can go all the way, uh, we can go to six, normal, as opposed to long, like, five or whatever. Where you say Capcom gives you the choice to unbone one set of weapons from a monster. What monster gets the good weapon treatment? Dude, that is so hard. That is so incredibly hard. Because there's two that I would really want. There's... Actually, there's three that I would really want. But... For looks alone... It'd be Glavinous. It'd be straight up Glavinous. Ray, please help. I was in love with this game, but now I'm so burned out. I'm using SNS, but reaching weak spots is hell. Not the moment Glaive doesn't do it for me. Should I learn a different weapon? <laughs> Reaching weak spots with sword and shield is hell? Why? What monster are we even talking about here? Seems like a very specific monster. Uh, but in my case, it would be... It would be Glavinous. Because I like the red and blue. I really like the red and blue. So I would go for Glavinous for the for the cool looking weapons. I mean, come on, guys. Even just yesterday, I ran into a Twitter post where someone was complaining about the bottle opener. Poor guy. He's like, man, I don't want my great sword to be a bottle opener. Well, that's too bad. Because it most definitely is. Look at that bottle opener right there. <laughs> I even put a gif of someone opening up a beer bottle with one of those. I'm just like, come on, dude. That's so unfair. How are you going to do my boy Glavinus like that? His tail is a great sword. Just cut Glavinus' tail off, put a stick on it, done. Looks better than this. Come on, guys. Anyway, uh, I came into the smithy with a purpose. Came into the smithy with a purpose, and my purpose. What's the Garuga? Garuga's 210 
poison. 20% affinity, 598. What are we looking at for Rathian in the same? 598, 390 poison. I think Aruga's gonna reach purple sharpness though, and Rathian probably not. I don't think Rathian's gonna reach purple sharpness. Actually, you can see it goes to white. Well, but you can't see the final. Yeah, Garuga is going to reach purple sharpness for sure. You can see a little bit of purple there. Oh, but Garuga is long. Okay, that makes it easier then. We definitely want that. Rathen for poison. Um, the water gun lance is going to be non yells for sure. I don't think there's a normal shelling dragon, is there? Actually, there is. The dragon seal gun lance. That's a lot of dragon damage. We might be crafting this gun lance as well. Shara Ishvalda, unfortunately, is not woke. Not woke enough. I find it interesting that we haven't unlocked this one yet. Dora's gun lance is useless. I'm not sure why anyone would craft it. Zeno is gone forever. Bum, 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 bum. All right. All right. I think the only thing that I really want to craft from here for now is... Where's an ogre? First I'll want... How do you put it in the wish list? I never do that, so... I think I made a mistake there. Zinugru! Did I wish list it or not? I can't tell. I mean, I'm pressing the button, but nothing's happening. You cannot forge this equipment. Well, I know. That's why I want to wish list it. Everybody always telling me to use the wish list. It's not working! Work on how to control a monster to a wall when you clutch claw. There's a guide specifically just for that. In the channel. Just look clutch claw guide in the channel. Should be the first result. I think it's even the featured video on the channel right now. It's much... I am pressing... Try, I need to be an upgrade. Okay. I figured that was something wrong there. The rust is so real. You can tell that I've used the... Um, the wish list so often, right? You can really tell that I've used it many, many times. Okay, wish list that. Wish list that. And wish list that. <laughs> like a boss. Like a boss. Uh, I wanted to get another one. I'd like to get a fire one. Unfortunately, there's no good fire ones for normal shelling, is there? A fire one would be very useful. I'm probably going to end up using Rathalos with long shelling for fire. Yeah, I think it's the only way to go about it. There is no normal fire. Oh well, it is what it is. Anyway, let's go wipe on that Teostra some more. Ah, uh, not Teostra. Kushala. With my... I still can't get over the fact that I have a Brachydios gun lance that I've downgraded to look like a Juratotus gun lance because I want more blast. I don't understand the logic behind this gun lance looking like this now. But okay. Today we're going to teach that Kushala a valuable lesson that he will not soon forget. And that lesson is that you do not mess with the Iron Breakers. Because the Iron Breakers going to fuck you up. Anyways. Burakan, I have a Namiel Insect Lave downgraded to cool for affinity. That can't be intentional. Like, there's no way. You guys think that... 
Like, imagine, imagine downgrading the look of your Namiel Insect Lave, which sure, it's not the best looking Insect Lave in the game, but it looks good. Imagine downgrading the look of that to a goddamn Kulu Yaku because you need more affinity. You're just like, what? I'm sorry, what? I'm, I don't, what? What are we talking about here? Has everybody lost their goddamn minds? Is that what's going on? Everybody losing their goddamn minds? Does not seem very reasonable to me. Augment bone system is kind of a mess. Capcom really screwed it up bad. I mean, I don't know, because I kind of feel like I need to get to the highest levels to see if it changes. Do you guys know if it changes when you get to, like, the highest level possible on that thing? Uh, we are missing potions. Hot potions. Let's craft some of these, shall we? There you go. You know what? You know what? I'm gonna do it. Where are the cold potions? The amount of cold potions we have, you guys. I'm not even trying. The awesomeness just comes out naturally. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> so are you going to try your luck again with Gunlance on Kushala? Yes. I will beat him with Gunlance. We will defeat him. It's just one of those things that it might take a little bit longer. But we'll get him. We will get him in the end. It's starting to fill up my casual set little bit too much but there do, do. here we go we actually did get bombardier this time around that's rare error con you can buy hot potions from the vendor i can also save my zenny and craft them <laughs> what's well, so different about master kushala than arch tempered kushala There's not that much difference, to be honest. It's just by the time I got to Arch Tempered Kushala, I had a I had a good set to counter him. And in the current in my current save, I don't have a good set to counter this Kushala. Which makes him uh, a little bit harder. I should actually have brought Rock Steady for him. I really should have. But anyway, we got some practicing to do, so let's get to it.
is my worm special? Where did my worm stake end up? Oh, never mind, idiot. Forgot to load it. First hunt, guys. First hunt. First hunt of the day. Give me, cut me some slack. Cut me a lot of slack. Is the sound too loud, by the way? It sounds a little bit louder than usual for me for some reason, but I think it should be about right. Sounds good? Good. Whoa! I didn't know you could do that. That one's good. Did he sacrifice one of the, uh... One of the tornadoes for that? I don't look like it. Too shabby if I can say so myself. Catch your Let's go! Wonder if I'll be able to score a mount off of this ride. I miss regen on weapons. Me too, Wada. We'll get it back soon enough. Did you find the wide shelling level 6? Nope. Pretty much confirms no white shelling. Yep, I'm not I'm not surprised. Like I don't expect the monster that I miss with the white shelling level six. get the tornadoes to move against each other. Interesting. I got so much blast this weapon. Screaming out.
Shala? Are you still there? Oh, there you are. second I thought he was going to try to prevent me from picking up the camera. Ooh! I get it, Kushala. You hate me. Well, I'm not so hot about you. I really hate this guy at this point. I never really had that many problems with him uh, in world, but for some reason, and this one, he's just a goddamn nightmare. I think one of the other things is also fighting him in the forest. I just prefer fighting this guy in the friggin' recess. I'll take you there. Oh crap, I just dropped my thorn pods. Still have it. Oh. Please drop ammo. Pretty please. More dice. Okay. I like putting it on the legs. And I have not been able to get this slope to work. make me want to do a critical status bomb. These blast blocks feel so damn good. And then he leaves. He's like, well, I've done all this stuff. Now I'm going to leave. Oh, at least tornadoes leave with him. Is that new? Tornadoes used to stick around, yeah. I wonder if tornadoes always leave with him or they just happen to finish at the right time there all of a sudden. I don't think tornadoes used to leave with him, but that's good. Thanks for running me right into that tornado. It was real nice. I'm gonna need to make another windproof set for dealing with this guy. That's what I need.
damn it. All the way here, huh? gonna go old school combo on him. You guys remember the old school combo? Because he's so damn fast all the time. Setting up for a full burst isn't really a good choice. I'm just gonna, I'm just gonna go old school. OG baby! Wait, no, I got a different solution this time around. Can I get some, uh, some of that ammo? There's some rocks here. There we go. Yoink. Oh, we're actually back on the ground. Terrible idea. You gotta be full health. Before. into the air he goes. He's a coward. He's just a coward. That's all there is to it. Big old coward. He's actually scared of me. If he isn't scared, why doesn't he fight? Oh no. Oh no. Oh, okay. No, no. I, th I thought we were in a different era. I was like, no, there's no way. I think you're a coward. You refuse to fight him in the air. I'd love to fight him in the air. Give me wings. One full burst combo right there. I should get a mind's eye. Yeah. 
bitch ass down here. That would have been a beautiful worm steak if not for this garbage aura. Come on. Actually, I didn't bring more max potions. Great. <laughs> that was terrible. FDA, please don't talk about things we haven't seen in the stream yet. Though technically speaking, that particular subject was already spoiled yesterday, but... <clears throat> I'm definitely bringing Rocksteady next time and going kamikaze on his ass. Alico carry. Oh no. Oh, fuck it.
about enough of your nonsense. Oh, don't go anywhere. Stick around. We're gonna have some fun. Give me this. Give me the head, give me the head, give me the head! Ugh, slow! Find that son of a bitch. Find him and destroy him. Come here, let's go. Let's go. Mind to share penguins? Share penguins? What are you talking about? What weapon do you use, LXBT? And are we talking about Master Rank Kush? Hey, Rakan, please make a Gunland set. Already did. I'm wearing it. I need a couple of more decorations to really make this set. Um, oh my god, is he is he where you think he where I think he is? No. Where the hell are we going, dude? Why'd you take us this way? Wait. Oh no 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 no! What did you do, you dumbass? Wakey, wakey, motherfucker! Oh, wait, what? What? No! Sit, stop! No! Sit, nye, nye, nye. Don't fall! Don't fall! I didn't know he didn't fell! What? What? I'm having got hacks! Shoot! Thank God for that. Friggin' hacks! That's what you get. That is what you get, my friend. And I want you gone. I want you gone, you understand me? I don't want to have to see your face around here again. I told you guys we'd get him. That was a close call, though. Close call. Work on what's the best, fastest way to level up your master rank. Yes! Oh, ho, 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 yes! Yeah! Large Elder Dragon Gem! That's right! You're goddamn right! How do you like them apples? Ah, uh, boys. As I was saying. Uh, um, now we've gotten some practice. Should be easier next time around. Anyway, that's gonna allow me to craft my Namiel gun lance. Anyway, what was
was the question? There was a question here that I missed. Having a hard time triggering the new SNS moves. Any tips on videos you've made on how to time it right? I haven't made any videos yet, but I can show you. <clears throat> two! We got two of them suckers! Mmm! Fucking A! Two of them suckers, man. That's what I'm talking about right there. Today is a nice day to hunt. Go get some likes on stream. That was two large elder gemstones, dude. Mm. Can you share your build? Sure. Very nice, Sue. This is not the gun lens that I tend to use, so let me just swap that. This is the gun lens I usually go for. Uh, and then the build is this. It also has uh, artillery secret and guard up. It also has a bunch of more stuff, like it's got a lot of fucking skills. But this is what we're rocking right now. It's not finished by a long shot, but it's workable. It works. Hunt Kushala again. I don't need to. I just wanted to hunt him to see if I could do it. Now I can farm him. Um, let me get those uh, Namiel weapons. And then I'll I'll tell you about the SNS stuff. Is it this one? Yeah. Ba bam 390 water. Beautiful gun lines. Beautiful gun lines. I should use it for a bit. For shits and giggles. Look at that bad boy. It's fucking huge. Oh, interesting. Namiel's gun lance stretches outwards instead of sideways. I'm not sure if I've ever seen a gun lance that does that. That's hella cool. Anyway. Training area. Also, guys, I should do a room tour. Uh, last night, I actually customized my room with all the stuff that was available to me. I made the thing that I liked the most, and I'll show it to you guys. Although, there aren't really as many options as I expected. I expected a little bit more, but, you know, it's still a lot of stuff. Okay, so the the SNS stuff. Wait, before I do that, <laughs> you guys see the animation? It's different. Chunk. He goes chunk. <laughs> Wonder if there's like a firing animation for it too. That looks like the usual firing. Oh God. That quick reload looks terrible, though. What the hell happened there? Look at this. Ah. It's like, after seeing quick reload for so long, it's almost like you're bending your arm all the way down, like you're making a, a reverse 90 degree angle. It's like, what? Oh! Oh! Make it stop! Ugh! <laughs> it's so weird! Isn't that weird as fuck? I can't be the only one that thinks that's super weird. What do you think Capcom had in mind when they designed the charge blade, uh, the um, Namiel charge blade? It's like, you know, that's the thing. You can't really understand because like, you look at this weapon, right? This is a beautiful fucking weapon. It's a beautiful weapon. All around. Even though that animation's kind of weird. I'm exaggerating how I, how I feel bad about it. I don't really. It's like, whatever. It's kind of weird. But either way, it's like, you look at the weapon, it's a beautiful weapon. All over. Even if you don't like the style that the weapon is going for, you can still agree that it is very much uh, an appropriate weapon for the monster that you fought. So it's like, when you ask me, what do you think Capcom was thinking with that charge blade? 
I just don't know the answer because you look at some of these weapons and they're fucking beautiful. It's the same thing with Brocky, right? Like, you look at Brocky's SNS. Oh, actually, I don't have Brocky's SNS. Actually, I don't have any SNS. I didn't craft any SNS. But, um, Brocky's sword and shield looks amazing. It looks amazing. Then you look at, um, Brocky's dual blades. And in the words of um, Gaijin Hunter, they look like fucking chicken drumsticks. They're chicken drumsticks with uh, a wrapper, a Brachydios wrapper. You know, it's like, imagine if you had a pair of chicken drumsticks and the box, instead of being KFC, it was like purple and green, right? And that's the dual blades. It's a KFC box of chicken uh, drumsticks. But instead of the KFC, you got a Brachydios in it. Anyway, in regards to the tips for the uh, SNS, for starters, you got many ways to get into that combo, right? But I'm just gonna go for the more basic one. You do an attack, go back, press triangle. So the way it goes is you can actually hear the sound in the red glow immediately after um, after you do the thing. So you go like this. Wait, I haven't done this in a while. Give me a second. Wait. Oh, it's triangle, idiot. For some reason, I thought it was circle to continue the combo. Okay. So basically, if you just pay attention to the red glow... Red glow. Red glow. The last one was a little bit late because I'm trying to say red glow before it, but basically it's the second. Well, no, no, not the second. The second wrong. The millisecond your your character begins to glow red, you press the button again. And then eventually you'll start to understand how the animation works and you can get it right every time. Like on that one is when the shield goes down, on this one is when the shield goes down again, and then the other one is when the weapon goes back, right? If you look at the animations, I'll tell you exactly when you're supposed to press it. Like, shield goes down now, shield goes down again now, thrust. That's it. That's all there is to it. It's like you look at those red glows and just look at the position that your character goes in. Having said that, like, you're not always going to get it. Perfect rush, like, it's going to require a lot of practice. But they have made it easier since the, um, the beta. Another thing that I can give you as a tip is you definitely should do this. You go to options, and in options, if you go to, where was it? Is it in camera? Uh, no, it might be here. Yeah, it was there. Wait, I saw it. No, that's character names. Where's ca Oh, here we go. Player silhouette. You go to game settings, and you go to player silhouette, and you put that on distinct. What's that going to do? Whenever you're behind something, you can actually see your character so that you know the animation that your character is in. Because otherwise, you're going to miss Perfect Rush a lot. I remember during the beta, I didn't have this turned on the first time. I was like, dude, this Perfect Rush thing is insane. See, I missed it right there, but it's one of those things. You're not always going to get it right the first times, but after a little bit of practice, it should be gold. You know? It's just practice, 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 practice. There's like no easy way beyond just like looking to when you're glowing red. There's no easy solution to it, really. Anyway, let's swap around to the Namiel gun lance. Namiel! Did that help? Did that help at all? It's like the longsword, need practice. Yeah, the. Um, whatchamacallit? The. Foresight Slash. The name was eluding me. Hey, bots and bot, what's going on, dude? Oh, you're welcome, the Juarez. SNS is amazing, dude. I love SNS. I love SNS too. It's just right now I'm really focusing on Gunlands. I want to be the best Gunlands user I can possibly be before I start moving on to the weapons. And I feel like I haven't really gotten there yet, you know? I'm still struggling a little bit on certain situations. And so I, I still, I keep practicing. I keep hammering away at it. 
Oh, I got the bracky one. Okay, doesn't matter. So I told you guys I wanted to show you my room. I customized it a little bit, but I don't have that many things. Um, I don't have the full stone thing because the, um, the code that Capcom sent me, the early access code, was, uh, I think it's just a regular edition. So you don't really have the stone thing that you get. Um, but you guys are looking, you're like, but your walls are stone. Yeah, there's a quest that gives you the stone walls, but you still have the, the wooden. Uh, stuff in between however having said that I actually prefer it like that I think it looks cozier than just stone all over like stone all over would probably be cold Whereas like this you have better insulation with the wood I changed the the flooring to be also stone, but it's this type of stone I like this type of stone a lot. Uh, you can also swap that to be like uh, Whatchamacallit you can swap that to be wooden. Uh, I bought the upgraded bed from this but I didn't like it as much as this one. This one looks more cozy, so I stuck with this. Put a couple of basic shelves in. I put these medusas here. You know why? Because, <clears throat> like, just imagine that it's nighttime, right? This whole place is dark. And then you get these medusas in here. It's a nice little thing for you to fall asleep to. Right? That was, like, the justification there. I swapped the food on the table so that we got a nice little hunk of meat. Put a couple of macaques in here. And then I put uh, Dark Hero CC in the corner here. Right? Uh, Dark Hero CC and two of his friends. Uh, they're just over there in the corner. <clears throat> I swapped these plants around. They don't matter that much, though. And I put a portrait of Zora and the Handler. I mean, that's pretty much most of the customization that I did. I think it looks good. I put um, some fish in the, the aquarium as well. I put two, two anglers in there. You guys can see those two anglers down there. I put a wet fish so that I can sharpen my weapons if I need to. And I put those fish because they were red and they looked kind of good. So I was like, yeah, this is this is all right. Night lights, he's scared of the dark. I knew that was coming. I'm not scared of the dark. I just like mood lighting. I think it would look nice. Handler portrait, you're goddamn right, Kroz. You're gonna come at me saying you don't like the handler? What's the matter with you? What's the matter with you? Tonight on Cribs, you need the rare pet, Rui. I don't know what the rare pet is, and I don't care. Can you show the Shara Longsword? Sure. Dark hero in the corner, exactly. Rokan, should I take 40 more base damage over wide sharpness for a replacement? Longsword to get started in Iceborne. Kane the one, if you are getting started in Iceborne, most of the fights are not that challenging. Like, there's people that finish the Iceborne story without even swapping their gear around. So it's like, if you don't want to swap your gear, you don't have to swap your gear. But ultimately, I would look at it as like, just see this as a chance to try out different gear sets. So I would advise you craft the new longsword. Just try it out. See something new, you know? Because, I mean, ultimately, I feel like the experience becomes boring if you don't swap uh your gear around a little bit throughout the thing like i went through um three different sets throughout the the campaign so to me it's all about that i'm not if you're starting iceborne i wouldn't worry too much about min maxing you know it's just like do whatever you feel like doing let's put duck duck you guys are evil man you guys are just evil uh, okay, so right now what we need to do is raise our master rank. So I think I'm gonna go into the guiding lands. And anybody can join, I guess, because I just need to raise that place up. Let me just swap gun lances. I want to take Namiel's gun lance, just to rock it for a little bit. Let's put a pendant on here. I think I only have the red pendant, right? I also have the bronze hunter symbol. Oh, they put the pendant in a different spot here. I like it. I like the fact that it's not at the very bottom. That actually looks nice. I think it would have looked better like on the shield, like in the middle of the shield, maybe. But yeah, that works. Yo, Philippe! Valeu, galera! Tudo bem? 
You mean rub it in about? You mean to rub it in about how good it looks? I'm. Um, I'm sorry, Wada. You know that I like the Charge Blade too. Feels bad. It does feel bad, but there's nothing I can do about it. I mean, someone that has a bigger following than me is already trying to do something about it. You guys should see um, uh, Gaijin Hunter's video about that stuff. Like, I never... Th I, I actually got to a point throughout these live streams where I, where I was just thinking to myself, like, am I just being a toxic asshole dunking on these weapons? Like, am I the problem? Because usually, you know... You guys know that I don't like to delve too in-depth with neg negativity, right? And I was just going through these weapons, and I'm like, dude, these some of these weapons look like garbage. And I began thinking, like, maybe the problem is me. Maybe... And now, with Gaijin Hunter stepping up, I'm like, no, it's definitely not me. If, if Gaijin Hunter, of all people, is complaining about it, you know there's a serious fucking problem. Gaijin Hunter doesn't complain about nothing. Like, someone could feed Gaijin Hunter a shit sandwich, and he would possibly ask for seconds. No, that that's... I took, I took that analogy a little bit too far. Disregard that. Um, you guys know what I'm saying. Gaijin Hunter is like one of the nicest guys on the planet. He never complains about anything. Made a whole video complaining about weapon design. It's a nice point. Oh. So I'm not surprised. I'm uh, somewhere above 50. I'm not exactly sure where. Uh, 51. Let me see. Decorations. Current equipment. Oh, that one doesn't have any decos. Feels bad. Dude, Valkana's gun lance is just so damn good. So damn good. Once again, PC mods will save the bone plagues, but it's next year. I mean, you say that, but console people are gonna get the shaft anyway. But then again, PC players are getting the shaft for the next five months, so... It is what it is. Do, 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 do. Feel free to join the Guiding Lands if you guys want to. I'm gonna just be killing random stuff. You think Capcom will add Gorgal? You mean Gormagal? I mean, Gormagal is a fairly easy monster to implement, in my opinion. The hard thing is the the lore justification for Gormagala being here. Uh, because Gormagala would have to infect other monsters with viruses. And so, unless they just do them as an isolated thing, and then they don't put viruses on other monsters, Gormagala is easy. But, you know, if you want to add Gormagala, you need to do the virus mechanics, otherwise it just doesn't make that much sense. Can you augment it yet? No, I'm missing a lot of materials for the augmentation stuff. I gotta raise my hunter rank. Yeah, Skullis, people were saying uh, the other day in chat that it's probably the same skeleton as Volstrax. Yoink. Alrighty then. I'd love to go do... Yeah, I'd love to go do that guy right there. Garuga. Hey, bruv. What you up to, mate? It always takes too long. I'm always hopeful, by thinking maybe today is the day that he's gonna hesitate, but they never do. Whee! I still need to go back upstairs to get my ammo. I'll be right over, Garuga.
Wait, why can't I pick up? Isn't this supposed to be ammo? Anyway, we're just gonna do this time. Why is he falling asleep? Is that a sleep weapon? No, that's breath, right? This weapon's doing the work. Like, Namiel's gun lance is no joke. Even though Valkana's I still think is better overall, Namiel's isn't messing around either. I don't know if Garuga's weak to water or what the deal is, but...
got me. Yoink. I saw a lot in the animation and just like, uh <laughs> It's like stuck on the double charge slash. Free real estate. so much. much poison Try it. Try it. I dare you. Ha! 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 You funny! Ha! 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 Let's sharpen this bad boy up. Yunk. Garuga. The abuse is real. Uh, the axe he's using, uh, I actually don't know. It might be... Oh! It looks like Zenogre. But Zenog the Zenogres have sleep? That's weird. Uh, no, 
this. Let's see. Uh, ba -ba 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 -ba. Let's get that gyros. My rotten veil is pretty low. Catch a red. Never thought I'd see the day I felt sorry for a Yan Garuga. Yeah, dude. I mean, but then again, it's not really fair. We're we're at a point where just three of us will probably manhandle just about any monster unless it's tempered. Yoink. Oh, this roar doesn't actually affect me. That's two missed. See, now I'm gonna mobilize your ass in the dirt. And after that, you can bet your ass I'm sticking this worm stake deep inside. Don't even stop, why don't you? This guy is giving me more troubles than the, the young Garuda. <laughs> Opening I had. in the head in the middle of that move. <laughs> Holy crap. Way to yellow sharpness. Damn, son. That's a lot. I really shouldn't preload. I should use the guard point, but I'm so lazy.
catch a ride. Yoink! Ah! Look at him getting away! We should kill that Narga next. I'm gonna carve his homeboys over here. I don't have any materials from these guys yet. Let's get Rathian. I need Rathian mats. Might as well get those. I'm going to need that for upgrading the Rathian gun lance, which is going to be probably the best gun lance for poison, I would imagine. I guess I got the cooldown for the Raider Rad. Raider Rad. Catcher, catcher. Catcher Rat. Wait, I can do it now. Interesting that you don't get the Effluvium debuff anymore. Or at least if you do get it, I haven't gotten it a single time throughout this whole expansion. Guys, can we still get the Effluvium debuff? Do you guys know? got it once then I've been really lucky so is there a clear best gun lance I mean depends on what you want from them um, from the ones that I've seen so far I think that for both wide shelling and long shelling you would want to go for um, Valhazax uh, and for normal shelling I really like Velcana I'm not sure if it's the best but I fucking love it get sharpness for days It was just the sabotage water, clearly. It was totally not an accident.
Gajalak, as I'm always speaking you guys up and you betray me like this, how can you do me dirty like this? Okay, water's not doing it, I'll do it then. Gajalakas, I'll forgive you if you kill this rat right now. Gajalak is why I thought you were on my side. She had to go. She couldn't handle it anymore. I love the numbers this gun lance is putting out, though. It's real good. The fact that it's got some affinity built into it, it's really good. What? What's going on? Oh, no. Don't do this to me, Gajala, because you're going to make me kill you. I'm going to let it slide this once. I'm going to let it slide just this once. Don't let it happen again, though. How is she even walking?
lovely. Bloody marvelous. Take this and yoink. Bulgar Anjanath goes up next. Man, we'll let that Nargakuga slide. It's probably my fault, sorry. Oh, it's already loaded. I was like, why can't I load? Gunland seems to have gotten a massive buff, those numbers. <laughs> you should look at other weapons numbers. Like, I'm pretty sure long sword's gonna be way better. But yes, Gunlands has received a significant buff. It's uh much, much better than it used to be. And it's not just better, but no no no. It's not just better, but it also feels more fun. Now where are you, Fulgor and Janet? And Jeanette. Why is he tied? Why is this guy tied to the friggin' Coral Highlands, though? I guess the first time I saw him was in the Coral Highlands. Got a little full burst there to get him started, though. That sucks if we can't trigger each other's. Maybe I just missed it. I gotta try it. Double the procs, double the fun! Four player gun lancing is gonna scale like nobody's business, dude. Son of a bitch! 
God damn it. Well, that's that. He does so much damage, that son of a bitch. Rip the dream. Take your time. Oh, lol. Gunland's new meta? It's not. It's not, dude. It's not even close. It's hella fun, though. I'll tell you that. I friggin' love it. Mm -hmm. What did you kill? More like what killed me. Wait, are you using the exact same gun lance as me? You are. <laughs> I should refresh my items. Dude, guiding lands are a bunch of fun. But I do feel like there's going to be a lot of players that are going to feel uh, a little bit lost when you get to the guiding lands. I mean, I myself still feel a little bit lost when it when it comes to the guiding lands. Still not 100% sure of what I'm doing, but I know that just keep hunting monsters is going to raise my hunter rank and eventually it's going to unlock the stuff that I want. But basically, I just got to try to level the areas as much as possible. gonna be glorious. Oh, well, there's a pink rat in running about. Should get hurt too after this. Hope they bring a canter on your can loss in later update. Hey what what the hell?
practicing this new move that I saw in the video. Which basically allows you to side strike. I never really did that in World, but it is useful. Like, you saw me go back and then sidestep side step backwards. That is so fucking good. I never knew you could do that. I gotta give the guy who made the video a shout out. My windows just like blue screened on me, huh? The one where I was following chat, so I can't see you guys for a bit. I don't know what's going on there. Oh, it's coming back. It's a good job, windows. Thank you. I appreciate it. Right in the middle of a live stream, too. I can see it again. <laughs> Is it only one stake at a time or could you have multiple attach if each person fire runs off because it's not it's one per player. And no, four of them don't really do double damage. Because they nerf the amount of damage you're... Like, if I hit someone else's, it's gonna deal less damage. Okay, Wada doesn't have it. really overkill what what is like you know what <laughs> fuck this fulgar engine app for killing me he killed you didn't he i think i saw you faint there fulgar engine app, dude he's actually one of the killers he's a fucking killer two cents plus your piss that your captain card crapped out dude that must be going around my capture card crapped out, I just replaced it today. I just went to get one of my old capture cards and now I'm using that. Uh, is that the pink Rathian still? Let's get pink Rathian. Most of Coral's we Coral Puke's weapons aren't that great because you can get Namiel's version which is probably going to be better. There's a Paul Loom wind coming it seems like. Oh, that's not a problem. It's just one of the small birds. Never mind. Oh, dude, I told you to go to the pink Rathian. Why don't you ever listen to me? Never listens to me this right. Worth it. He killed us both, right? Yeah, he did. He carded me and then carded you. What are you doing? Go through it. Go through it. You useless monster. Come on. Look at how scared he is of that bitch Puke. He's so scared of the Puke Puke, look at him! He's so scared! Oh, he's so scared! Don't be scared of the Puke Puke. No! I hate, when I have good ammo, I hate picking up bad ammo now. It's so bad. Like, I'm, legi I'm legitimately scared to spam the circle button to pick up stuff along the way because if I pick up bad ammo it's such a big L for me like that oh 
Oh wow, really? My friend, the wall. Right there, we both put the spike in at the same time, but black one's already um, it already expired because he used cheaper ammunition. But because I have a bomb one, it's gonna last me a while. Still. You gotta get the good ammo, man. You gotta shell out. Switch axe! Dude, that is amazing! Look at that! I had never seen the switch axe in, in motion. That is beautiful, dude. Namiel's weapons look so good. With the obvious exception. You guys are right. He swapped weapons. That might have been why I disappeared. Catch your red! 
I love the fact that I keep saying this. I'm not actually going to play Borderlands 3. I just like saying it. It was something that got friggin' ingrained in my mind from when I did play Borderlands. You always had Scooter going on about, Catch a rat! Catch a rat! And I was like, well, there you go. Now that's stuck in forever. <sighs> Which is the obvious exception. Yeah, that's the charge blade. those redstone fish. trying to do something that I don't usually do, which is the um, evade loading. I struggle with that one still. See that precision? Did you see how I shot right next to Wada without knocking him off? That's pro gun lancing right there. Can we see some likes on the stream for some pro gun lancing? That's what's up. Right next to him and didn't hit him. She's leaving. Or maybe not. No, she left. She's gone, man. She's gone. Wish me luck. Time for crazy chicken. Ooh, good luck, Kegrin. You need a hand? Like, we can take a break and go help you out if you want to. If you don't want to deal with her. First kill solo. Sure thing. Uh, I'm out of bombs, dude.
<laughs> now that's a wake up. That right there is what we call a wake up. Well, let's let's abuse it a little bit more, just a little smidge. Oh damn it! I wish he was still on the air. I love that little stop she just did, where she just went like, I smell death, and then she just died. <laughs> that was so cool. She's just going at it like, I smell death. <gasps> Damn, Black Blitz is really mad. Like, I get it, she carded you like twice, but <laughs> you don't have to be so upset. Well, since Kagrin doesn't want any help, uh, let's go get that Narga next. I love riding the Aptonauts, by the way. One of my favorite uh, dinosaurs is a Triceratops. So I like these Aptonaut dudes. Don't, they're not a Triceratops, right? But, you know, they got the big armored face. I kind of dig that. Nope. See what I mean, guys? Gotta be super attentive. Make sure you don't mess up your ammos. There's a Legiana too. And I dick myself for one guy. you guys in a second. Keep fighting the Naga.
Barb Hell. It's a good thing there's no fall damage. I'm gonna have to piss her off before she'll agree to come with me. Lady. This is getting pretty sloppy. Fucking mad already. I enrage this lady, Anna. It's like, I don't want to slam her into the wall because I want to save the ammo to slam her into something else. But she is just not enraging. set up as a waste of time. Should have just focused on our game. Take her over to Narga. So far away. Well, I'm not gonna waste any more time. Let's just go hard. Again. I wanted to slam them into each other for sport, but that took too damn long.
Kakuga will remember that. He was gonna get away anyway. They made monsters a lot harder to prevent. I mean, certain monsters. Prevent them from getting away. And even the ones that you can't prevent, sometimes they'll just do something that you can't stop. Oh wow, was that really my final potion? That means I have to go back and report after this one. Yoink! Yeah, there's a there's a TT that messes you up, Kegrin, on that quest. It's pretty cool. <laughs> Makes you feel any better, Chris? You gotta finish main quest in world to get G rank. Yep, that's right. Ow! He plucked me out of the sky. far away.
else, right? It just walks on the ground. Do -do 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 load it. Take me to your leader. Oh, there's a Diablos in here. We got to kill him. Best gun lances at the moment. Uh, the one that I like the most is Volcana. Namiel is also very good. And then... Um, I also crafted Valhazax, which is good for long and wide shelling playstyle. And I plan on crafting Zenogres as well. Uh, I also have... Rocky for a blast solution. So, you know, there's a lot of good ones. But unfortunately, there's no white shelling level 6. No, Venge, not all of them are good. Like, all of the wide gun lances, forget about them. Just pretend they don't even exist. All of the wide gunlands trees. Pretend they don't even exist. I don't have bombs. What? Why you do this? Okay, fine. Not a big fan of capturing. I think that's the first capture we've done in the Guiding Lands. Speaking of which, I gotta go report and pick up some more mats. White Shelling level 6 is <laughs> Arch Tempered Colt to Roth ma uh, Master Rank. No. I'm just gonna say no. I don't accept that. Oh, wow. Large Wyvern Gem, Rathian Ruby, Rathian Ruby. That's actually not that many rewards. Oof. Trashy, trash, trash. 54. Everything leveled up. It's gonna take a while to level every single area, dude. <laughs> Wonder if I can summon a Zenogre. Let me, let me actually just take a bio. I'll be right back. I didn't capture Kegrin, wasn't me.
Okay, so I want to summon a Zenogre. Let me see if I can. I can't. Why not, though? I can summon like three TT Yakus. That sucks. Can anybody summon a Zenogre? Or is it only the leader that can summon? I think probably only the leader can summon, right? It'd be cool if I could summon as a Nogre. Only leader? Okay. Hey, Mateos. What's up? And this gun lance, the, the one that I was using is Namiel's. Uh, I don't have Bombardier right now, do I? Crap, I don't have oven roast, oven roast going? Get it done. Get it done. I think I'm going to take uh, a break from Guiding Lands and we're going to go kill a Savage Devil Joe then. We'll come back later, level up stuff some more. Looks like the maximum level is level 5 at this point. A lot of people have been asking me, Rurkan, Savage Devil Joe, Savage Devil Joe. We're doing Savage Devil Joe. So white five is like long six. Nope, long six is more powerful. White five is just bad. From my take, white five right now is just bad. Black Bits, I am going to solo him. First time I fight a monster, I always solo it. So let me see, what's Devil Joe weak to? Probably It's Thunder and Dragon, right? I have to decide between Water and Ice, because those are two viable gun lances that I have. Oh, I got nothing. Well, in that case, we're taking Vulcanus. Now, I'm not sure if I have a quest for him. Let me see. Bonjour. Bonjour. Ça va? Give me that savage devil, Joe. Oh, wow. This capture quest, though. Almost makes me want to go for a capture. Three golds. Damn, son. Damn. Now that I'm probably going to go for this. This one looks good. Do, 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 do. Did you do Tempered Rathian and Nightshade already? Yes. I think you were here when I didn't it? Weren't you here when I did them last night? It's super easy, dude. Super easy. It has nothing to do with Tempered Karen. 
literally nothing to do with Tempered Karen. The capture quests I have for him are like the best. Uh, ancient forests. That probably means campaign. This month, does master rank uncap like normal hunter rank? Yes. to check on my stuffs. I think I might go for a voucher here. How many gourmet vouchers I have? 17. 23 regular vouchers. Because I think this bad boy is going to hurt. I think this bad boy is going to hurt. Solo him with no palica. Why? What? Is that the new rule? You can't use your palico either? Like, what the fuck? Uh, hey, Ezekiel. <clears throat> yeah, don't worry about it. Like, you didn't know who it was. Let's go... What am I... Okay, I wanted to get items. Actually, let's go Elder. Let's let's really go hard on this guy, because I don't know. A lot of you guys keep building him up to be some fucking ungodly beast. So I'm going to go doing? in hard. And if he turns out to be a little bitch, I'm going to be a little disappointed. That's all I'm saying. I'll use Charms or Armor either. I'll use the sling. Yes. Yes. I think that's the only way to do it. Let me just check how we're doing on Steam. Can you see the Steam from here? The only way to see the Steam is to come to the Steamworks, huh? Oh, okay, we're good. I think I did one this morning just to prevent the prevent having to do it on stream because I know that. Some people get bored watching that shit. Now... Do I have everything? I think I do... Yes. Kill him with the Hadouken emote. No, I'll kill him with um, the pistol emote from Devil May Cry. How about that? Does that work? Go, go get him. It's a thick one. It's good, it's good. Oof. It 
if that had landed like on his upper body, I would have been screwed. Well, I mean, what the fuck? Double roars? That's bullshit. Dude, I got shafted so bad. So bad. Just like, no, we'll just both roar at the same time and fuck you. And now die. <laughs> RNG Jesus right up my ass. Not excuses. You know it's bullshit. Anyone that's been in that situation, you know it's bullshit. When you die and there's literally nothing you can do. You just die. That's it. It's like, nope, now you're gonna die. Glavin is going to fuck you up. Or my boy Glavin is going to run away. Bitch monster. He's a bitch. That's all there is to it. He's a cheap bitch. The cheapest bitch I've ever seen. He's a two dollar street crack whore, is what he is, this fucking guy. Okay, so it's not useful for me to take all that shit. Because he's gonna one shot you regardless. So I might as well get rid of defense down. I'm gonna need Armor, thingamajigs, these, I can't wait for the tempered version of him, it's gonna be so good, it's gonna be the best. And I've heard Gunlance is the best matchup. <laughs> Gunlance the best matchup against Devil Joe? What? <laughs> Gunlance. <laughs> yeah, right. Yeah, right. <laughs> Dude, them jokes at this time of the day, dude.
So we're just ignoring mechanics now. That's the deal, is like we just ignore mechanics for this monster? I have guard up. I'm supposed to be able to block that. I'm so glad his armor is a piece of shit. I have no idea how glad I am that his armor is a piece of shit. Like what? Dude! Why can't I block anything he does? Like what's the point of having a shield weapon then? Dude, that's insane! Like, I can't block anything. Good thing I have an insect wave set. Push comes to shove.
again, dude. Those were behind you. Nah, not quite. Not quite. Is he dealing damage to himself? Was it everything you had hoped for, Rickon? I mean, that, that takes a whole new definition to the word cheap. Like, that's not even bargain bin at the dollar store. That's like a hobo is running a sale. That's like a hobo garage sale. Where he just stole some shit off of someone and he's selling it to you for like 10 cents. <laughs> That's the level of cheapness on that fight. What the fuck? Well, you can't block anyway, so what the fuck do I need a shield for? I think shield weapons on him might actually be somewhat of a disadvantage. Is this one the one that I was using? I love how with the with the friggin' insect wave instantly get rider. No problem. No problem. A drink, a fall down. No problem. I don't even have a good kinsect right now. I wonder if I have more materials for that. What's up, Megan? Paolo Muthik for everything else I have. 
I should kill a Paul Lumu. Now let's go kill a Paul Lumu real quick just to max out the uh, Kinsect. Dun, 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 dun. What monsters are here? No problem. I mean, I should have like a a problem or investigation, right? Fucking seriously? Seriously? I don't have a single Paolumu other than a capture? Guess I'll take it. Bum bum, bum bum bum. You have a hunt, Wada? Put it up. If you're up for it. I mean, I'm, I'm doing that in multiplayer. It's Paul Lumu. Who cares? How long have I been playing Monster Hunter in general? Uh, let me see. What's the closest one? It was shortly before Monster Hunter 4 came out. And I've been playing it pretty much ever since. Because I played Try, didn't like it, because I didn't know any better. I played Try, I didn't like it, I didn't know any better, and then a friend of mine taught me how to actually play the game in Freedom Unite. And then at that point, I just started playing it nonstop. But Freedom Unite had already been out for quite a while when we started playing that. So I think it was shortly before Monsanto 4 was released in Japan was when I began playing it. And then naturally when 4U hit, I played 4U nonstop, then Generations hit, played Generations, Gen U, no not Gen U, because Gen U came after World, so after Generations was World. Considering buying For You, For You was a great game. For You was, uh, I mean, Four was actually when the mechanic was introduced. But in the in the West, we only received Four with For You. So, but that's when the mechanic was introduced for the mounting. Was in Four, I'm pretty sure. Hey, that's the first time in a long time that I've landed all the way out of here.
Does anyone know a good money farm in Iceborne? Same thing as in World. Find an investigation with three targets. Take a bandit mantle. Beat the crap out of everyone. Get money. I think that's probably the easiest way to make money. I'd rather get three portable remasters if we were going to get one. Because we never got to play that one in the West. Shield power gun. Getting to do the piercing attack. <clears throat> what insect waves would you recommend for Iceborne? I don't know. I haven't played too much with insect waves, but uh, depends on your playstyle. Like, if you want a uh, ground glaive, you're probably looking at acidic glavinous. If you want air glaive, you want the best of every element, which is probably going to be an amiel for water, Velcana for ice. Uh, I don't know which one for fire. But Rocky for glass. Yeah, that's a general idea. running. Velcana is not the best ice glaive? Okay, then I don't know. It's just Velcana is one of the best ice weapons, so I just assumed the ice glaive was going to be the best as well. Crap, he's upstairs. Why am I still in forever combat? Where the fuck did he go?
Dude, I'm so lost right now. Like, can we exit combat with this goddamn pink Rathian already? Jesus. Ten years of combat. Ten thousand years, and now you come into my realm? You are not prepared. That's fucking pink Rathian right there. Just like, oh, I'm so mad. So big and mad. You have no idea. Ten thousand years. You're not prepared. Let me waste my goddamn Kensei. Oh, you've got to be kidding me. Thank you. Love the guys who lock her.
love how he's taking all that beating and he's just like, no, I'm still gonna leave. I don't want to stay here. I don't feel safe. Let's go, Shamus. <sighs> Man, there's been a long time since I've seen him do this. Usually he doesn't last long enough to do this. Considering the amount of damage we're dealing with this insect wave, I'm not particularly confident. I am not particularly confident about this. An elemental one would work way better, but I don't feel like crafting a new insect wave just for that. Yes, I have seen it actually, Chrono Garcia. It's a beam struggle. It's really cool. There we go. That's the pick where we need it. We're good. I can now fully upgrade my Kinsect with Blast. Yeah, I'm not, this, my insect glaive set is not really making me very, very excited about this fight. I'd be much better with a, an elemental set, but it is what it is. I'm going to give it a shot anyway. Shada Ishvald has appeared. Actually, I should try out Shada. Because that's the main reason why I made this set. Oi, oi. Everybody was being naysayers about it. Now is a good time to test that out. Let me see. Um, no, I want to try it solo. I want to see if I can hard carry through it or not. I don't even need the materials, I'm just doing it to test out this set. Dude, why is it that I never get the fresh food for the buff that I want? Never. Like, what the hell? And then it gives me rider. Dude, that's twice. That's twice it's given me rider with almost no fresh food. 
desire sensor, man. That desire sensor is there just to troll your shit. Okay, guys, let's see if this works. That armor looks so Soulsborne. <laughs> it's not supposed to. Like, it's, it's high-tech armor. It looks like alien technology. Turn around. Turn around. There we go. I got a random on the other side. Okay, I got it. Still not close enough. on the wrong side. Oh, this 
side should drop shit on it too. Why does it always have to be this side? Anyway, it doesn't matter. I can get the proper fucking spike to land on it. Yo! This way, home slice! Spike is still here, so if I can ram him here again, we can do it again, I think.
God damn it. I've actually never seen him do that, bring the lasers back.
Alright, reload. Can I use the box? Thank you. Now, give me your energy! Ah! This fight is still a crapshoot, even with this. Jesus Christ. I just want to tack up, Bell. Even with an insect lave, what a crapshoot. I don't think I've ever killed this boss without carting. I'm not sure.
Actually, it was easy. See? I was right. I thought he had a lot more health. It was easy. Compared with all the other attempts we've done so far, this is the easiest one. So yeah, I can farm this guy. It just takes a long ass time. It's not me getting better, dude. That's not it. Like, when it comes to the insect glaive, I can assure you that's not it. About this specific boss, it's just, it's an insect glaive boss if you're a melee fighter. Potentially longsword can be good too, but like, it's, it's an insect glaive boss. I called it the first time that I saw it. It's just, we got unlucky with that stun. I wonder if Savage Devil Joe has more or less health than this guy. But anyway guys, I am going to take a break. Uh, I'm not exactly sure what time we're going to be coming back tonight, but I will put up an event as soon as I know. Uh, I know that you guys want to see Savage Devil Joe. That's going to be the first thing that we'll do when I'm back. But um, for now, I do need to take a break. So I'll see you guys in a bit.